On the 19th of August, we have a new moon in Leo, Maga Nakshatra. It's a great time to dream big, get in touch with your inner king or queen, to feel the natural abundance already available to you, and to ask for the help of your ancestors. Your ancestors really want to help you. They are simply waiting to be asked. So in this meditation, we'll take a soul journey to the top of a grand building, from which place you will have a moment to be with your ancestors and to ask for their help going forward. Are you ready? Then let's begin. Follow the bell into silence. Take a deep breath in and on the out breath, let go of absolutely everything. Everything you did on this day, this time, this era, and even your identity. Allow the next in breath to fill your imagination. And I want you to look down and see what you are wearing. Is your outfit from another era, another country, a time in the future? Use your imagination to invent whatever you like. You can be anyone or anything you like in this soul journey. Have fun with it. Be creative, be grand, be bold, be Leo, be Maga. As you look up, you see a grand building. It's breathtaking. In this realm, you are more psychic than ever, and you get a sense that the ancestors want you to look after this building for them. Somehow, this building is connected with your lineage, and it's now yours. You get a sense that if you are ever lost in the future, then all you have to do is take the winding stairs to the top of the building where you can easily connect and speak with them. As you ascend the many flights of stairs, you are being filled with positive affirmations, positive ideas. You are being shown the way, the way to inner peace, material abundance and personal power. As you take the first steps, you discover that inner peace is a choice that's available to you at all times, regardless of what's happening around you, regardless of the moods of others around you, regardless of your surroundings. Next, you are being shown the secrets to creating material abundance. You're being shown that more comes when you value what you already have. And as you continue to ascend those stairs, you're being shown that the flow of what comes in is activated by what you give out. You keep ascending those stairs and more thoughts fill your mind. The fact that like a king or queen, you need not worry about finances. You should merely expect them to be there for you and they will be. As you continue ascending the stairs, more realizations flood your mind that you are inherently powerful. There's no need to feel restricted by jobs or bills or hardships or opinions of others. At any given moment, you can rise above 
earthly limitations. You keep climbing those stairs and another thought comes to mind. And that is through meditation, through the mind, you can go beyond Saturn's orbit and be entirely free. Now you have just a few stairs left and you have the major realization that you are able to climb to the top with ease. An open balcony beckons you forward. An entire city shimmers gold flecks of light gently below. As you look to the sky, there's a unique feeling, a feeling that if you speak to your ancestors, you will definitely be heard. I'll leave you now to speak with your ancestors. Tell them how grateful you are. Tell them if you feel lost or alone or if things are hard right now. They will help you. They want to help you. They know what it is to live an earthly life and I can tell you they are cheering you on for being on this earth at this time. They see the hero in you that chose to be here at this time and they hope that you will also see how heroic you are too. Follow the bell into silence. <laughs>